Rochelle of Fabian Morgan. In this video, we're going to learn how to make this necklace out of duct tape. In addition to your roll of duct tape, you're going to need a template to make circles out of, a china marker, and a pair of scissors. Let's get started. My cutting mat is 34 inches wide, so I'm going to use four strips of tape that are as wide as my mat. I'm basically going to create a double-sided loop using a pattern on one side and black on the other. I take one strip of the black tape and place it on my work table, sticky side face up. Then I place a strip of the pattern tape on top, but only covering half the length. Then I take a second strip of pattern tape and cover the remaining half of the black strip sticky side. I use a second strip of black tape to connect the ends and create a loop. On the black side of the tape loop, I trace circles that are spaced approximately 1 eighth to 1 quarter inch apart. I decide to use a combination of one half and one inch circles. With a well-oiled pair of scissors, I cut out the circles, but I also make sure that I leave them connected to each other. creating a chain of circles and I don't need any jump rings. Every now and then I check on my work to make sure that my cuts are even. Here's a closer look at how I trim down each circle. I'm using detail scissors, which makes cutting a lot easier. There is still some white china marker on the black side. Not to worry, it rubs off. circles for my necklace, but you could use any geometric shape. My necklace is also 34 inches long, so I could double strand it or single strand it. And I think I could even triple strand it. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching.